Alrighty, Lumberjacks, welcome back to another single-player episode. Uh, this time around, we're going to get back to our forwarding project here. So, uh, we're basically just cleaning up all the stuff that we had here from before. Uh, remember when we had that big pile of crap there and it was all mixed up? So we sorted that all out. Um, now we're bringing in all this stuff <coughs> from that other uh, that other landing where we're cutting up over there. Uh, so I'm just going to kind of see if... I was going to see if I could offload it directly from this onto the truck. I don't know if that's possible. But it would save stacking it and piling it, which sometimes feels slightly unnecessary. Let's get rid of that bottom one. I don't know. We'll see how this goes. Except we do have quite a bit of room on the bunk, so I think it'll be all right, but we'll, we'll see. Yeah, that seems to work all right. I like how it just kind of pulls itself down there. It's kind of nice. It starts to... Oh, we got four locks. <laughs> Felt like I had more there. I guess not. Oops. Like, so once you, oops, once you try to, like, or once you start to, like, grab these scoops, it just kind of, the scoop of the uh, bucket just kind of pulls itself down and digs into the bottom, which is, I don't know, feels kind of cool. I could be grabbing bigger scoops, but I'm just not really sure where the end of that deck is yet, so we'll get there. And now we get to officially see how much one trailer fills up on a bunk, or on a truck here. How many bunks on one of these trailers? That's a good one. This is way easier doing it this way. We don't have to stack it on the ground and pick it back up again. So the nicer we load it on the truck, or on the uh, ground and forwarder, the easier it is to load on the truck, that's for darn sure. As you can see, we don't have a lot of wiggle room whoops, in terms of uh, space on these things, so... One more scoop here. I think that's probably most we'll be able to get on this one here. There we go. Yeah, that's a tricky one. There we go. Boop. Good enough. Okay, we'll lock that one up, drive it ahead. It's actually a nice little bunk. Looks good. Right about there. Now, what we should be doing is also cleaning up this stuff that's laying around here. Oh, maybe I can't reach this stuff. I don't think I can. Oh, I can. So maybe we'll get rid of some of this stuff, too, because it does need to go. There we go. Perfect. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so the more of this we get rid of, the uh, easier things will go for us. So I'm just going to kind of see how much I can scoop out of here. Now, when you start to see it tip into one side, you got to really be careful because it <clears throat> doesn't take much to swing it out of there. All uncool like. There we go. That's what I want. That looks better. I don't know how far this will reach. I should really increase the length of the head on this thing. It doesn't feel like it can reach very far for how big of a machine it is. I guess where the loaders can reach further. Well, maybe not. Just that secondary arm needs to be just a teeny bit longer, I think. But luckily we have this loader just hanging out here so we can kind of shimmy this stuff down to it. And this one's got a very long arm so we can really push it up there. <clears throat> but the problem is, I don't know how those stabilizers would do. Like, that one's got a pretty long arm. That one's got a pretty short arm. It's got The first arm, primary arm, seems about the same length, but the secondary arm is very short. Um, so it kind of makes it a little bit uh, a little bit questionable about how it would how it would be on there. But mm. uh, Oh, we might as well just grab that one, too. What's the point in coming back for one, right? And then maybe you could bunt this up a little bit against that front bunk and get a little bit of space. I don't know if we have enough room to get it in there. Do we? Oh, yeah. Let's straighten it up. 
Uh, oh, about right about there. I love when it rolls all nice and just folds into the spots you want. It's the best. I think there's actually some over here too. I can't quite get that pile. I'll just leave that pile. No big deal. I just want to get that one closest to the road because it kind of screws up our uh, turnaround sometimes. I almost hit it last time we were backing in there. Oh, that's a good grab. I like that one. There we go. There. Beautiful. B E A U. Scoop this one. Oh, I don't know. I think we can get all that on there. We're going to smash it in and see what happens here. Alright. I want to kind of roll this this way. There you go. That's what I want. Okay. I'm actually going to turn this because I want those butts to go the other way. Yeah, I think that'll sit nicer. I'm going to sprinkle the mode a little bit here and a little bit there. This one can get a little bit <coughs> pressed over a bit. And that one's just a little... I'm being pretty, yeah. Uh, just kind of splitting hairs here at this point, but... There we go, okay. Okay, lock that up. Can actually get this thing moving. There we go. Now, uh, we should have enough for that last bunk, I think. Yeah, I think there's enough on here. Looks, oops, looks like it. So I'd say this thing fills up at least maybe two and a half or two and a quarter bunks on a truck, on a triple, triple bunker. It's catching on. There you go. That's weird. Interesting. All right. I left that little bit of a gap underneath the uh, stakes on the border, so you can scoop in there with a the big guy like this. Not worry about losing your logs. There we go. Now, we should be able to just kind of sneak up there and snip this guy, bring it back over here. And then grab it all. There we go. Yeah, I like that. Feels very satisfying. It's actually very efficient. Like, we haven't 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 had any like really crazy glitches or anything, so that's a that's a good sign. Between the forwarder and this guy, they work together quite well as a team. Press this side down just a little bit. There we go. Okay. So we do have a little bit of wood left there still. So maybe what I'll do is I'm going to steal this guy, which I think is running. Oh, now it's running. Oops. And I want to bring it down here, I think. A little piece out of here, too. Oh, there's two in there. Oh. We did a very good job of that, didn't we? Yeah, depth perception. Whatever, good enough. Now this row, I just want to shimmy this way. Might have shimmied a little too hard because I think it went sideways. Darn, that's not going to be very good for a load. Let's see if we can correct that. Just trying to keep them nice and straight because if, well, as you notice, if you try to load it with the dangle and they're a little bit off axis, it sure makes a mess. Um, those are kind of a weird angle, so let's see if we can kind of put them back a bit, turn them a little. Oh, oh geez. And this is not how you do things, kids. 
If you're watching, avert your eyes, because this is not how it's supposed to be done. Alright. That looks like a bundle. Bundle of shit. These are kind of off, eh? Hey? Let's try to make them somewhat lined up. There we go, that should be good. And even if I grab them from the angle, it should be good. Let's try it. Let's try it. See what happens. It's the last bunk anyway, so I don't think we're going to get them all on there, but I'm going to try. And we'll go like this. And uh, there's no way I'm going to get all that on there. It's not going to fit. Although I would like it to fit, but it's just not the way it's going to go, I don't think. We're already pushing it with this grab, I can tell. That's okay. So what I'll have to do is have a reserve pile for when we fill up trucks. That's a pretty, <laughs> it's a pretty skookum shot. Oh, we can reach that. There we go. Boop. I just want to get a little bit closer so that I can do this. Oh, Lord help us. I don't know what we're doing. This is very against the law. Well, it went on. <laughs> now we're doing off highway loads. <laughs> All right. Okay, I'm going to leave that right here. <coughs> Perfect. Now, I don't know if that even that locking strap will even go that high. Won't it? Oh, yeah, it did. Look at that. Looks good to me. All right. Party on, man. Let's go drop this bugger off the mill and that should begin. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Bring it around and drop it off. We're just loading up these shorts though. This one bin is just stuffed full of freaking things. Eventually we should take all that out of there and reload it on trailers, but just to, you know, be OCD. And lock it and drop it. Oh, drop it. And I'm just gonna put this guy over here for now because we'll need to buy another trailer and hook it up. Do some deja vu here. Alright. Okay, so I'm just going to leave this guy here. Uh, pretty successful load for that. Uh, and then next time we come back, we'll be on the other project there. Uh, cutting away, doing some more grapple saw stuff. Uh, yeah. Alright, if you guys liked the video, leave a like. Don't forget to leave a comment and hit the subscribe button. Uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.